You're probably familiar with the term blogging, and you might associate that with entrepreneurs, photographers, stay-at-home moms, but the reality is that blogging is a great way to add functionality to your church website and drive traffic to it. I'm going to share with you some helpful tips on blogging with your church website and the easiest way to add a blog to your church website. Blogging is a great way to share thoughts and devotionals from your leaders and pastors in your church, and it provides a more human feel to your church website visitors. By having these kinds of things available, website visitors will have a better understanding of who the people are behind the church, and they can make a stronger connection before actually even coming to attend a service. Blogging has always been a great way to optimize websites for search engines. By having a blog on your site, it means that you're feeding regular new content to it all the time, which gives search engines like Google more to work with and index so that your website has a better chance of coming up for a variety of different searches. This in turn could lead to more website visitors, which in turn leads to more foot traffic at your actual church. Blog posts with devotionals, church announcements, upcoming events, all of this stuff is great material to share through your church's social media channels. And it's very easy to make it so that other people can share it through their personal social media channels as well. On top of social media, your church could even take this content and replicate it for the church newsletter that goes out in email or the things that you print out and put in your foyer at church. So there's lots of great ways that this content can really get some extra mileage and be used even further to engage more people. Now, here is the easiest way to add a blog to your church website. First, log into your church website and then go to edit the page where you want your blog to live at. Click to insert share faith feature and select blog. From the categories listed, you can choose the ones that you want to display on the blog page. Then you can pick the layout and how many posts you want to display at a time on the page. Finally, click to insert and save the page and you're done. Now that you've gotten to see how easy it is to do something like this, why don't you give it a try yourself? You can do a free demo of ShareFaith Church websites today. All you have to do is follow the link and pick a design to get started. Visit ShareFaith.com to learn more. God bless your day.